Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 2 One City Challenge. When we last left off, uh, we were about to discover the um, trade, well, in eight turns, and then we will be able to build Marco Polo's embassy. We have the Colossus already, so our cities produce quite a lot of uh, trade, which is excellent. And um, now we need to also take care about production. By the way, I should probably deassign this uh, luxury for the moment. Yeah, because we researched the mysticism and we still have a few turns until we will need that guy. Okay. Hmm. So I need more production. How can we do that? We can't get any production from the ocean squares for a long time. We will be eventually, but not until late game. So we should start transforming terrain. I think uh, grassland into forest will be the best option. We don't have any other options at the moment because we don't have engineers. Okay, let's end the turn. And once more, let's have a look. We will grow now. So I will change the tax rate back to 10%. That should be enough. Yep, it is. Okay, we have one happy, one unhappy citizen. Excellent. And we will go over here, actually, and transform the wheat into silk, if I'm not mistaken. Change the terrain to forest, and that should do the trick. Okay, Spanish have nearly completed the hanging gardens. We don't care about that a bit. We will have uh, the marketplace. Excellent. And now we can research map making and literacy. Okay, so just because I want to build a trireme as soon as possible, let's do map making. And I want to do the trireme to explore this uh, missing tile over there, which could be a special resource. And if it would be whale, that would be excellent. I could. Uh, I would have then 10 production, which which is what we need now. Okay. Marco Polo's embassy, 29 turns. So we could build four caravans in uh, eight turns with uh, enough money. Hmm. So we don't have enough money. We would need about 200. We didn't find any huts with gold. And we we could actually change the tax right now to produce much more taxes than science output, but hmm, but I don't know. Library twelve turns. Hmm. Okay. Let's do library first to increase our science capability a little bit. We could do a diplomat as well and move around. I don't know. We just need that production first because production 10 is really what you want when the rush buying caravans. Okay, let's do the library. I don't know if that's a good idea, but it's the best idea I have at the moment. Map making eight turns. Okay, then let's just wait for that silk. Oh, we will grow now. We have so much food. That's uh, that's not good, actually. I would prefer more yeah that should be enough when we grow i would prefer more production instead of 
all this food. We have reached size 8 and we can't grow any further because we need the aqueduct. Okay, that's that's good. Let's just check if uh, luxury 10 would also be enough. No, we would be unhappy. So we actually need to stay at 20% luxuries. Uh, once we discover map making, does this produce any shields? Whoops. No, it doesn't. So let's uh, work over here. Once we discover map making, I will switch to um, producing more. gold instead of science output. Okay, we can now make triremes. We will switch to either literacy or masonry. Now our goal, next goal will be either astronomy or medicine. Actually, let's uh, I think nobody has researched philosophy yet. So I would go for that, starting by literacy. However, I will change my tax right now and go to zero or close to zero with science. Now we have income of 20, which uh, makes it uh, a perfect opportunity to start building those caravans. Yeah, that's what we should do. Hmm. Still only seven production and even with um, silk I think we will not reach production 10. So my rush buying caravans tactic will just not work. Hmm. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. How many turns will this take? Five turns. So let's uh, Let's buy it. And the turn. And do the trireme. Excellent. Maybe we can find wells there and that will solve our problems. Okay. Let's uh, help them a little bit. Rush by the set of the warrior then the phalanx and uh, okay and the diplomat and then we'll need two turns unfortunately to buy a trireme that's why you want hmm. we can buy this as well no we can't okay so we have to buy we have to wait two turns we could disband a, a unit, but that would bring unhappiness, I guess. Yeah, actually. So we have four unhappy. If I disband this guy, we will have only, we'll have two happy and two unhappy. Yeah, I think I can actually do that. So let's get rid of this uh, warrior. Yeah, two on two, that's fine. And now it will be built in one turn. Perfect. And the turn. Go there, it's fish. Well, at least it's something. But yeah, fish is not really what I wanted. Because fish only increase food production, right? Let's uh, have a look. Fish, fish, fish. Yeah, increase amount of food from one to three, but nothing else. And I don't need food. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Well, let's at least um, explore a little bit with the trireme since we have this unit. And start building the caravans. Yep. 
Okay, what can I do with all this? Three and two. Change to three and three. Okay. Three and two to one and three. Um, everybody else does produce at least one shield, so it doesn't make sense for us to assign them on ocean squares. Okay. Yeah, we have serious problems with production. Serious problems. I will move with the ship a little bit, at least. I don't want to consult the High Council. Thank you very much. And um, let's do some rush buying. And the rest, okay. We can do just like that. We have eight. Why do we have eight? Oh, because uh, we have the silk now. Perfect. But we still need two more shields. And I have no idea where to get them from. Hmm. Okay. End the turn. You, my dear settler have absolutely nothing to do. I think it's time to change one of these uh, tiles to forest as well. Let's take um, which one? One of these two maybe. Let's uh, let's take the bottom one and transform it to forest. That will give us two additional shields, I believe, which is all we need. For the moment, that is. Okay. Just explore around. That's fine. Okay, caravan will be built very soon. You can carry beads and fortify that's fine. Next turn. We require aqueduct, but we can't afford it. So let's just uh, rush by a few things. Diplomat. And, well, I, would, I could say one more turn on the caravan by rush buying settlers first, but I guess that's really a waste of money. So let's continue like this until we can get those 10 shields production. Very good, you can carry silver, that's fine. Move, fortify, and the turn. And it's not much over here. It looks like we are on an island. It definitely looks like we are on an island. Okay. Let's continue rush buying. Diplomat. And caravan. Okay. Next turn. One, two, three. Yeah, we are on an island. What do you know? <laughs> I wonder where the other civilizations are. Let's end the turn. So, was there a better place to build a city? I think this one is not a possible location, or is it? Yeah, it would be a possible location as well, but we wouldn't have access to more resources. We would have access to hills, though. Our production problems would not be so grave as they are now. 
Over here it's just food, so... Oh, this would be a good spot. Yeah, this would be a good spot. However, it's too late already. This would be an excellent spot, actually. Hmm. Yeah, two whales, fish and buffalo, two hills some forests and grassland potentially if we deforest the area even some ocean tiles yeah that would be that would be a better starting location than the one we have right now yeah but uh, decision has been made already nothing we can do against it uh, we have quite some gold but i don't want to concentrate on research at the moment this is caravan number three i believe so okay and we have this now so let's um reallocate things like this perfect now we have production 10 which will make things much much easier Okay, I think you can just go here and sleep for now. There's nothing else you can do for us at the moment. Perfect. Did I order them to sleep? Yes, I did. Okay. Next turn. And now you can see we have spent one turn for the first 10 shields and we'll Rush by Phalanx, Rush by Diplomat, Rush by Settlers, and we have spent 75 gold right now, but in the next turn we'll have a caravan, which means we have built a caravan in two turns for 75 gold, which is a very good deal. Okay, next turn can carry food supplies no problem and because we have four caravans which are basically worth 200 shields uh, we can build the Marco Polo's embassy right now okay so go help build wonder you too Then uh, over here as well. Perfect. And the last one. And that's exactly the 200 shields we need. Marco Polo's embassy is ours. Excellent. So let's end the turn. And continue with... Uh, well, basically building more caravans. We'll be doing a lot of them. And now each, uh, now with the production of 10, it will be much easier. Now, we can't um, contact any civilization on foot because we are on an island. That means we need to find a way how to... Oh, we, there's a another piece of land there so i will take two caravans which i will build and uh, just sleep there and board the ship and try to find some other civilizations Marco Polo's embassy will definitely help me. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven civilizations, okay. Including me, our power is weak, so there is actually somebody who is worse than we are. But um, it's been 19 minutes already, so I think we'll end the episode here. And when we come back, we'll talk to all of these guys, try to exchange the maps with them and also uh, technology and make peace and so on 
By the way, they are almost all icy. Oh, it will be so hard to get them to worshipful. Hmm. Well, anyway, I say bye-bye for now and till next time.